At City Hall on Monday, leaders gathered to discuss solutions to the bad smell that's floating around West Louisville. But residents came to this meeting saying it's not an odor issue, it's a health issue. Councilwoman Tammy Hawkins led the discussion on Monday, asking questions to the Metropolitan Sewer District. This smell has been overlooked way too long. Community members say it's been a problem for years, but lately it's gotten worse. It's really bad now. Very, very bad. MSD Executive Director Tony Parrott says while odors are a natural byproduct of a sewer system, the problem goes a little deeper than that. Louisville has a combined sewer system. This means it takes on stormwater and wastewater. But the system, which was designed in the 1800s, is self-cleaning and depends on rainwater to flush itself out. Parrott says a lack of rain causes the smell to get worse. So if we're not getting the rain to flush out a self-cleaning system, that will lead to a increase in odors throughout the system. As waste breaks down, it creates a colorless gas called hydrogen sulfide, which causes a smell of rotten eggs. That is the primary culprit within the neighborhoods. He says short-term solutions include replacing and repairing catch basins. Long term, we are going to be investing significant odor control improvements at our Morris Foreman wastewater treatment facility. However, many voice concerns the odor is impacting their health. You can feel it in your eyes, your nose, your throat. The CDC says at low levels, hydrogen sulfide causes irritation of the eyes, nose, and throat. However, Parrot says they haven't seen concerning levels of this in the air. The Air Pollution Control District says they already stepped in several years ago to push for solutions. Now it's about implementation. It's time to put those down on paper and share those with the public. Madison Elliott, WLKY News.